First Nations TV, your news first. The NT Minister for Remote Housing and Homelands visited the remote Aboriginal community of Gapuwiak to hand over the keys to 10 families moving into their newly built homes. 29 houses have now been completed in the community with another nine houses underway. The new tenants were very excited to move into their new homes and express some issues they had in their previous living environments. I was a bit um, struggling, me and my wife, because where we was living, uh, there was like a um, crowded house, yeah, and it was uh, very hard to live. We was sharing one washing machine, one kitchen, uh, one bathroom, me and my wife, we don't smoke, and it's very hard to tell people smoke uh, like um, 50 meters away from us. So I got, I got my clothes and I'm my, which bit we, I'm, um, while I move into here, so I'm doing myself for um, Dallasing home. Oh, that's better to get new house. We have 73 Aboriginal communities right across the Northern Territory in our remote homes package. So again, this is the national partnership agreement between the Northern Territory Government and the Federal Government to build homes in the Northern Territory. We have expanded our program. We hit a milestone just last month where we had built 100 new homes in the Territory in 100 days. So we're seeing some amazing works roll out across the Territory. Our apprenticeships, our traineeships can continue on with that work. We can see those qualifications and those skills develop and be certified and be ticked off. And we're also seeing, of course, the bigger impact, which is reducing the number of overcrowding in our community, which also has the benefit for education, for employment, for health in particular. The 38 new houses have been built by WTD Constructions, who employed a number of Indigenous employees under apprenticeships. This includes two local Gapawiak workers who have now completed their Certificate 2s in construction pathways and are now halfway through their apprenticeships. It's been uh, doing concreting. Concreting. Oh. After then, uh, putting on the bricks, and then putting on the steel, steel. and then roof, getting good for the rain. Yeah. We mainly focus on new builds. A little bit of maintenance here and there, from excavations to concreting, painting, bit of roofing, bit of everything. We get to do it all out here a sense of accomplishment you get from finishing a job. You know, you get a, an achievement, a good feeling out of it. As an Indigenous person, I feel like I'm giving back to the community. Once the remaining houses are completed, these apprentices will have the opportunity to work in other communities and with the new subdivision underway in Gapawiak, there will be a lot more employment opportunities to continue work in this community. First Nations TV, your news first.